Hi, my name is Joseph, and I am in prison. And this is not where I expected to be at this point in my life. But here I am. How did I get here? Well, it starts a few years ago when I was younger. My dad gave me this incredible coat. It's just beautifully made and, and I just I just love wearing that. But my brothers really hated me for that and uh, they one day grabbed me, they ripped the coat off me and they threw me into a pit. And then not long after that they sold me to some slave traders. And that's how I ended up in Egypt. I, I, I don't know what I did. I, I don't know why I deserved that, but somehow that's what happened. And I found myself in this strange land far away from home and not knowing exactly what was going to happen. And I didn't really know what God was doing. And I, I tried to do what's right and tried to follow him and, and honor him with my life. And then I found myself in a pit. I found myself as a slave. And I just didn't know why. Anyway, then things actually started to look up because I started working for this guy called Potiphar. And, you know, we got on really well and he started giving me more responsibility. And he actually put me in charge of pretty much his entire household. And I thought, well, this is all right. Things are looking up. Maybe it will be okay after all. And then there was this episode with Potiphar's wife and in an instant, like that, I found myself here. At the absolute rock bottom in prison. And it, it just doesn't seem to make any sense because ever since I was young, I've had this sense that God had destined me for something great. I used to have these dreams where I was in a position of importance. And thinking about that now just seems ridiculous. I mean, here I am in the lowest possible position. I'm in prison. But I do believe that God has a plan and that he will look after me. And so even though I don't know what's going to happen, and I don't know how long I'm going to be in here or if this is it for the rest of my life, I don't know. But I'm going to just keep trusting God and keep following him. So that's what I'm going to do.